Shipmates, CNO Gilday here with the Chief of Navy Reserve, Vice Admiral John Mustin. As your time serving as an active duty sailor concludes, I first want to thank you for your service, for your commitment, and for your sacrifice. I'd also like to recognize and thank your families. In the Navy, we serve as families, so please thank them again for their constant support over the course of your time in the Navy. And as you navigate this next chapter of life, take pride in knowing that your time in the Navy sets you apart in ways that you may not yet appreciate, ways that will be highly valued in the civilian workforce. Now, as you shift into your new role as a civilian and as a Navy veteran, I'd ask that you consider continuing your service in our Navy Reserve. Our sailors, active in reserve, are our most vital resource as they empower and drive the fleet forward. Shipmates, as you focus on your new journey, whether that's a new career, education, starting a business, family, or pursuing another dream, I want to let you know that you can do all of those things and continue to serve. In fact, Navy Reserve Service earns you many of the benefits and rewards of active duty service, but with added flexibility. Continuing to serve just one weekend a month and two weeks a year allows you to keep those benefits, including health care, retirement pay, education benefits, child care support, travel, camaraderie, and of course, a paycheck. Service in the Navy Reserve can certainly support you as you pursue whatever lies ahead. If you're interested in learning more about joining 58,000 of your shipmates in the Navy Reserve, talk to your career transition assistant today. Good luck to all of you, and thank you for your service. Shipmates, I wish you success in your transition, and I want to thank you and your families again for your service. I hope to see you back in the fleet.